Hello everybody and welcome back to another r slash farming simulator video. So yeah, we're trying out this version of uh, uh, Reddit with just the compact so I can't see the screw, so I can count my way down but then not see the the posts which is uh, kind of cool. But that way I can't be spoiled by what's going to happen. I mean, I know this one's a video but other than that I really do not know. So yeah, that's how we're going to be doing it and also, speaking of Reddit, if we head on over to my Discord server, which I will link in the description again for another 24 hours, uh, we actually have right here r slash farming simulator. So we can check out r slash farming simulator on my Discord. Just all the normal posts though. So yeah, to get started here, let's go with the latest post. Uh, the post that was most recently updated using my Discord server. So... This one just says bored. So just a question. Okay, someone bored of farming simulator. Um, that's, okay, here's the latest pip, here's the latest picture <laughs> we'll check out. <laughs> got latest picture, um, bubblegum. <laughs> and those bales do look like bubblegum. They do be looking like bubblegum. <laughs> that's pretty funny. I don't know what map this is. Actually, it's 17. Yeah, that's, that's a 17, uh, menu. Um, Interesting. Very interesting. Anyway, now we'll get on to the real post, but yeah. Just so you guys know, this is here. I'll link it in the description for another for another couple hours. We have a Me6 bot doing everything. But yeah, I'll pro it'll probably be a little while until I um make it public. I just, maybe a couple more things, a couple more roles. We currently have, um, we currently have the role subscriber and loyal subscriber. So maybe I'll make two more roles, like epic subscriber and maybe like super duper awesome subscriber I don't, I, I don't know um you know we'll, we'll we'll have different subscriber ranks and maybe the top one can be like an admin almost uh we'll see we'll see how we're getting from it because yeah a uh, loyal subscriber kind of just adds a couple extra things uh not really too much of a of a boost but i think you get a subscriber if you from just joining you get subscriber it's, unless you're mean and then you get it taken away um but yeah, anyway, that, that'll be in the description for 24 hours. Like I said, I'll be, I'll be releasing it soon, but just not right now. It'll be pretty soon. It'll be public, and, and when it's public, it'll be in the description of all my videos. And it will be a 100% link. It'll be all day, every day. But yeah, right now, it's kind of in the beta phase. So yeah, expect more from it soon. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started with having the map open heavily decreases FPS. Oh no, it's at yeah, 1, 100 something. I can't really tell the FPS number at the top. Uh, and then, okay, so it's like 100 something, and then opening the map, it's like 60 now. Hmm, weird. This involved of a sensation. First, anything over 60 is detracting from the game. It runs inside a compatibility shell designed for PS4 ports on PC. Giants itself has started, has stated that your best performance at detail is going to be a f frame rate limit FPS 30. And turn the limiter on, you can enable console and set the frame limiter to from 60 to 80 and get reliable from it. We're shoving your graphics detail down to get frame rates over 90 FPS. You're wasting time. Hmm, interesting. Didn't know that. Anyway, let's go on to the next one, which is right here. We need Hillmaster in FS. Oh, that's not it. Oh, it's down here. Okay. Right. Oh, and here's Bubblegum one. Here's Bubblegum. We'll probably skip that one, because, yeah. We just saw it. Um. Where were we? I don't like... Uh, I don't really like this too much. I don't, I don't know where I am. Oh, right here. Okay. Oh, that's so bored right here. Wow. We're, we, we got two knocked out just by looking at my Discord server. Wait, is this even top of the week? No, this is hot. Top of this week. There we go. Okay. And we'll go down like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and da, 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 da. we'll go to about this one. Uh, with, well, we'll go. Uh, I have every iteration of Farming Simulator. I have FS9 box. Uh, what? It's weird how 14, 15 is staked down, and then 20, 11, 20, 13. I'll cry because it's 20. Ah, that's interesting because it's 20, it's actually after all these. Interesting. Don't know why it's not safe for work, though. This is very safe for all kinds of work. Um, 
Yeah, weird. Okay, and it just quits you out anyway when you back out. So never mind, we're just gonna do it the normal way, I don't care. I like this way a lot better. Can't handle that other way, man. Is it even on top of the week? Is it even? It's on top of this week. Okay, let's find that one that we were just looking at. We're gonna be a not safe for work thing. Uh, you know, is that about m m marshmallows? <coughs> okay, we're gonna do it like this from now on. I'll just probably close my eyes or maybe just not look at them too deeply. Um, I don't know. I don't know, man. Uh, but yeah, marshmallows. They do be look like that, though. They do look... They, they do be like that, though. <laughs> the, the marshmallow bales. <laughs> Maybe that can be a new emote for my server, marshmallow bales. Because, <laughs> yeah, we have three emotes right now. We have red zone, uh, we have a, a bale wrapper, and we have potato. Those are the three emotes on my Discord server. I'll have to make some more. Maybe I can do Bentley. Maybe he could be an emote. An emo, 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 emo. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, man. Anyway, next one. Spotted in the wild, a puma marking its territory. <laughs> I mean, that's one way to mark your territory. Uh, that's a lot of nozzles of a chemical going down. That's one way to mark <laughs> your territory. It's like, this field is mine. I am killing weeds. Therefore, it is my field. Very good. Very, very funny. Very funny meme joke. Quite confused about the state of this subreddit. I mean, yeah, r, r slash farming simulator is also, I guess, r slash farming. I didn't even know there was an r slash farming. But yeah, it, it's both. It's just farming in general. Um, memes? Yeah, memes, memes. Give me all the memes. I don't know what you're what you're talking about, Mr. Stinger Up. But no, this, 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 this is how we roll here in the Farming Simulator Reddit community. Today, on the go with a little more performance. Ooh, that's a really nice looking class tractor. That's a class. It's like white. A white class with uh, treads. Hmm. Look, I've seen that before. No, I definitely haven't seen that before. I think I've seen the class with treads, but I haven't seen the white, the white one. Very intriguing and very interesting. I like it. It looks like there's some mountains. This is the new Alpine map. I mean, that's not released yet, but this could be like the Alpine map. <laughs> With all these mountains going on, you know? But no, the Alpine map isn't out yet. Pfft. Don't ask. I Sorry about that. Bandicam shut off. It couldn't handle switching between all the different things we were doing before. But anyway, we found what, what works. Um, don't ask. And like I said, I'm not asking. I'm not asking anything except for what is going on. You know? I'm not asking anything except for what is going on. Like, what, what's going on with that <laughs> You know what? You said don't ask, so we're just not going to ask. We're just going to move right along. Wheat Harvest Day 1 was a success. Ah, good job. Is that... It looks kind of like Welker Farms, but I can't pin it. It could just be some other map with a giant field. But yeah, the Welker Farms series, man. We had such big fields, and it was such a pain. <laughs> I'm honestly glad we're done with that series, because those fields took forever to do. Like, it was a whole job. I mean, that's how it usually is in real life. Harvest is, like, this big thing. But I'm <laughs> I'm much more content with, like, our Durango fields, where they can be done in, like, a day. And then it's like, oh, they're done. With Welker Farms, it's like... Uh, you got you got really, really got to sit on it, and especially if you're plowing the field. Oh, plowing those big fields, even with that big plow we had, takes super long. Like it's crazy. But yeah, you got two combines. Those look those are actually smaller combines than what we have on Welker. Those are very tiny. I would not want to be doing that field with those combines. No, thank you. Those are that's too small. I want big giant combines. And also, it looks like you cheated in all the money you could want. So why don't just buy big combines? If you cheat in money, just buy combines. It's fine. First submission in hopes of seeing what you all have managed to get stuck in trees. <laughs> and there's a truck stuck in a tree. Um, have I ever gotten anything stuck in a tree? I got a bucket stuck in a tree. Like, one of the very first episodes, we got a bucket stuck in a tree. 
<laughs> and that was the name of the episode too, Bucket Stuck in a Tree. Um, yeah, I'll probably link it because it'll probably be pretty easy with the new linking. Seriously, I, I'm going to go off on a rant a little bit <laughs> real quick. But yeah, I love the new way YouTube does cards. Oh, it's so much better. Before, with cards, you had to like grab the link, you had to open up a new tab, grab the link, like search the video, grab a link, and then usually with my videos, they don't, they're not the first thing that show up, because you know I'm not a big YouTuber, so I had to scroll down, or I just go in the playlist, scroll down, it's a pain. Now, when you act, when you add a video card, you can just go to search, and you can just search, like, um, what is it? Yeah. You can just search, like, Ravenport Episode 2, and then it'll pop up as my video. Or you can search Ravenport Episode 2 in, in the other videos, and it'll show up some other dude's video. The only thing I don't like about it is playlists. With playlists, you have to search playlists, but I remember all the names of my playlists, so it's fine if I, I type in the name of my playlist and mine shows up with a bunch of other people's. Um, but yeah, I really like it. It's great. I just hate how they had to remove the polling feature for it, man. Polling was so good, but, you know, you, you know, just do a straw poll. Just, um, you know, have a link in the description to a straw poll or something. It works, but it's not, it wasn't as convenient as the other one. Where I didn't even really get to experience it because I didn't have enough subscribers at the time. It participated in polls. I got like one or two votes and that's it. And usually, usually they were from me. But I've been quite impressed. Anyway, anyway, back back on to the subreddit here. We have I've been quite impressed by the class Axion A3 A30 at work. Axion, <laughs> wow, I've been quite impressed by the class Axion uh, A30 at work today. And yeah, it looks really nice. Class tractors, man. They just they look very class. That's probably their name, why they're called that because they just look good. You know, I'm from the I'm 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 from uh, America, and I, and I think these tractors look good. I would own one of these. I think I like them. I don't know if I like them more than John Deere. I don't really have a preference. I like all tractors. <laughs> all tractors look cool to me. But yeah, looks looks very nice. Very nice picture, and yeah, kind of jealous that you get to do real life farming. <laughs> Eastern Eurofleet. Got some old machinery there. Why are you keeping the combine out of this, man? Come on, let the combine in into this. Let the combine into the party of the Eurofleet. Maybe it's not an Eastern European, but come on, it's old. Like these things are kind of old. Maybe this thing's a little bit newer than these, but that combine's also kind of old. Come on, bring it in, bring it in, everybody. Come on and reunite the the detractors. <laughs> anyway. First time pushing up in the grain shed for real. Here's something my farm sim skills can help. Wow, so you have like a little pusher or it's oh I see. It's a JC it's a JCB tele tele telehandler with a little pusher attachment and you push the grain to the back. Very 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 interesting. Yeah, you don't usually do this stuff in farming simulator, you usually just put it in a silo. You're never usually just tipping grain in a shed. I mean sometimes you are. Like if you run a small farm, but <laughs> on both my series, we have perfectly good silos. Yep, perfectly good silos that we can put our stuff in. And even for Durango, like, usually sugarcane and, like, sugar beet, usually you have to tip it on the ground. But in Durango, we can just put it in the rail silo, because the rail silo will take anything. So, yeah, it's interesting. So, yeah, it's, it's, usually we'd have to tip, like, usually in Farming Simulator, you have to tip that stuff on the ground, because it doesn't go in your silo. But then mods have made, like, root crop storages to make that easier. Or you can just use the rail silo as, like, a cheat because you can put anything in the rail silo because you got to put anything on the train. So, yeah, it works. And I like it. The new trailer is out and is cool. Thank you, 82 Squared Studios, for making such amazing mods. Ooh. Versatile transport trailer. I'll have to check out this mod. I haven't seen it yet. Pretty cool, though. Yeah. I don't know when I would use it. Maybe on Durango? Would it be? Would it have use on Durango? I don't know. Moving stuff around? I mean, yeah, we do move stuff quite around quite a lot on that series. So yeah, I'll look into that. That looks like a cool mod. I would love to try it out. Ooh, it can be a long boy. Nice. 
Did somebody say sprayer? <laughs> oh my gosh. That is crazy. You have so many tanks. I don't know. That, that might just be the thumbnail. I mean, I've been doing a lot of the robo arm thumbnails recently. Actually, I haven't done quite I haven't done quite a bit recently, but yeah, that's crazy. Wow. What on the front loader, one on here, one up there, one up here. And then you have the sprayer in the back. You're never going to run out of space. You're always going to be able to spray. No matter what, you can spray and spray and spray until, well, you can't spray no more, which probably is never because you'll never run out of space. Pretty much. Lexian 6700 cutting outs. Uh, I actually cannot tell if this is real life or farming simulator. Okay, farming, far, farming simulator, okay. <laughs> From the back, it was kind of hard to tell, actually. But no, I can tell, though, the way that grains, the way that straw's coming out. But yeah, this looks like a really good map. Is this like Sandy Bay? I don't know. Looks like maybe, looks, it looks similar to it, but I don't think it is. Um, so yeah, Sandy Bay looks really good. And it looks kind of like this. But yeah, it looks really realistic. But yeah, I like it. I like the picture. I think it looks really pretty, and we're going to move on. He's enjoying the view. The helper observing the beauty of the tree he got stuck in. <coughs> Just a bunch of horizontal branches in your face. Yep, yeah, pretty much. Helpers. Helpers, helpers, helpers. They just... Mm. This subreddit is memeing on helpers because, yeah, they're not the best. But hopefully in, that, in the next FS game, they'll make the helper AI like, like course play. They should hire the person who made course play, which I think was... Actually, I don't know who made course play. I'll put it on the screen who made course play. But they should hire him to make the new farming simulator worker work good. Because he should be hired to make the AI good. Because course play works awesome. I love course play. Uh, I use it more than a normal worker. Though I still do use normal workers. You know, even if you have course play, normal workers kind of are good as well. Because normal workers, you can you, the field can be almost done and you can start them. With course play... You kind of have to start it right when you start the field. Yeah. Course play kind of needs to be like, okay, we're going to harvest this field with a worker, course play, go, and you just leave it to it. Whereas a normal worker, um, you, you, you can just set them off, like, whenever. Like, you could have the field half harvested, uh, almost, almost completely harvested, not harvest, barely harvested, and it'll work. Course play, you kind of have to be adjusted at the start, because if you're... Sorry, Bandicam shut up. Like I said, if you're not at the start with course play, you're going to have problems. Because course play is just going to do the entire field anyway, because of how it works. But, but anyway. Me every darn time. Are you winning, son? No, I tried doing logging now. My truck is upside down. <laughs> Pretty much. Pretty much. Or in Durango. Um, yeah, I started to do logging. But I found this tree that just won't, like, I keep on cutting it down. And it keeps on making more trees. It's really crazy. Look at this tree that just keeps on generating trees. <laughs> at least, at least that's, that's how I thought it was. Um, but it, it turned out you cut it down once, and then the tree came out, and then you still had a tree there. Like, it was still there. And then the logs were glitchy, and, um, yeah, pretty much. Also, that is a horrible posture. Do not play video games like that. Anyway. Gets me every time. 100 to 110. Motorcycle. Loud Rock Concert 115. 140 is a jet engine. 165 shotgun blast. 194 farm sim intro. Um, I don't know how true that is, actually. Let's try that out. Uh, start, uh, here. Farm sim. I don't know. How true is this? I've never really, you know, thought about it before, but yeah, I think it is pretty loud. Let's see. Okay, skip all this. Oh my gosh, it's so loud, I can't handle it! Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, if you enjoyed the video, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe for new videos, have a great day, rest of your day, I'll see you guys next time! Oh my gosh, it's so loud. Actually, it's not really. I have the volume turned down. Uh, let's see options. Take our volume. I'm proud. Okay, now it's loud.